Ghana is marking what it calls the year of return, urging Africans in their diaspora to come home. It coincides with the commemoration of more than 400 years since the first Africans were sent to America as slaves. The non-profit organization, the Heritage and Cultural Society of Africa, is set to hold an international summit to discuss the legacy of the transatlantic slave trade next week. CGTN's Nabil Ahmed Rufai sat down with its founder, Joanna Spanikie, Ghana's former ambassador to France and Portugal, and asked her why Africans in the diaspora should consider returning home. Africa is now reaching out to its diaspora, telling its diaspora to come home and engage in the development of Africa. So this is a platform um, for people to connect. They can connect on every level, on a business level, on a social level, on academic level, on intellectual level. 400 years after the slave trade, what has been the impact on Africans and those in the diaspora? Um, if you look abroad, until now, um, African Americans are suffering from discrimination in the U.S., and particularly um, African American males are being killed for no reason at all because of this legacy. Um, so the effects can still be felt till today. And um, unfortunately, um, after 400 years, there are still some major challenges as far as um, the communities are involved. And that is why we've asked um, to bring communities together. 2019 has been declared as the year of return by Ghana's president, Nana Ekufado. Uh, what does the summit seek to do in terms of bringing more Africans from the diaspora to settle here in Ghana? Our government has already taken steps to try and remove um, visa controls over Africans in the diaspora. So the former government, I think, made um, all Africans can come to Ghana without a visa subject to certain conditions. Um, and more recently, Jamaicans were told that um, it would be put into effect that they could also come. And I think this will build up and continue. So definitely the visa controls are very much something which um, should be dealt with. We are saying that there's this um, Aladdin's cave, there's this magical place, there's this place full of friends and family and joy and culture and laughter and experiences waiting for you. So come and have your experience of Africa in Ghana.